The North Atlantic Treaty Organization, or NATO, was formed in 1949 in the aftermath of World War II as a military alliance aimed at ensuring collective defense and stability in Europe. The primary driving force behind its creation was the growing threat of Soviet expansionism during the early stages of the Cold War. President Harry S. Truman played a pivotal role in the formation of NATO. Signing the treaty on April 4, 1949, along with 11 other nations from Europe and North America. At its core, NATO was built around the principle of collective defense, famously enshrined in Article 5 of the treaty. This clause states that an armed attack against one member nation is considered an attack against all member nations. This unity of purpose provided a security umbrella to Western Europe during the Cold War, serving as a deterrent against Soviet aggression. In the years following its formation, NATO grew in size and scope, expanding beyond its original 12 members. Over the decades, more European nations joined the alliance, strengthening its ability to ensure security and stability. NATO's first significant test came during the Cold War, where it helped maintain peace through deterrence, while the Berlin Wall, proxy wars, and nuclear arms races defined the era. But NATO's relevance didn't end with the fall of the Soviet Union. In fact, the alliance has evolved significantly since the 1990s, taking on new challenges such as counterterrorism, cyber defense, and humanitarian efforts. It has been involved in a number of operations, from peacekeeping missions in the Balkans during the Yugoslav Wars to fighting terrorism in Afghanistan after 9-11. In today's complex geopolitical environment, NATO continues to play a vital role. With rising tensions in Eastern Europe, particularly with Russia's annexation of Crimea in 2014 and the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, NATO's role in ensuring the security of its member states remains critical. It has also bolstered its presence in cyber defense and countering the growing influence of non-state actors and emerging threats. NATO remains a cornerstone of global security and diplomacy. It serves not only as a military alliance, but also as a platform for dialogue, cooperation and crisis management. Its enduring relevance reflects the changing nature of global threats and the need for collective action in maintaining peace and stability. In conclusion, NATO was born out of the necessity to protect Western Europe from Soviet aggression in the aftermath of World War II, led by US President Harry S. Truman. Today, more than 70 years later, NATO's mission has expanded and evolved, but its core principle of collective defense remains as important as ever in addressing the security challenges of the 21st century.